Hey, welcome to Rob's Italian Kitchen, hosted by me in this state-of-the-art kitchen. Now, check out this cool intro done by my special effects team, OFX House. They believe in me. Wow, what an opening sequence. And if you like that, make sure to smash that like button, share with your friends and family, comment, and don't forget, make sure to check the description and check out my website. Rob, who are you talking to? What's going on? Surprise! You're on a cooking show. Kitchens are full of surprises, aren't they? You're live streaming us making pizza? Everyone, this is my new friend Sharon. All right, I'll help you co-host. You sound like you've done this before. Didn't I tell you? I host shows like this all the time on TV and online. I actually just broke a million subscribers. So what are we making today, Rob? You promised me a hot, saucy Southern Italian pizza. Work's getting real hot in my studio kitchen. Hey, man, man, what's your Wi-Fi password? I need to check some basketball scope. I have a huge bet tonight. Hey, what's up? Ren, I'm in the middle of shooting. Live. Streaming around the world. Oh my bad. So what's the password? This is Renzo, my best friend. He was just about to leave. No. Hey, Rob is my best friend. He's a great guy. But sometimes he tries a little too hard, if you know what I mean. All right, well, let's get started on that pepperoni pizza. For those of you watching at home, or wherever you may be, the key to making the perfect pizza dough is to make it from scratch. That's the only way to make a truly crispy and chewy pizza margarita. Make sure to start with water that is heated to 110 to 115 degrees. Next, add one egg. Then add active dry yeast, two and a quarter teaspoon to be exact. Finally, add three cups of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of kosher salt, and one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil. Now here are some great pizza tips. One, make sure your ovens are set between 500 and 550 degrees. And use a pizza stone if possible. It just makes for a hot, even surface. Two, don't. And I can't stress this enough. Don't use cold dough. And three, stretch your dough. Now this is my favorite part. Now for the sake of time, I do have pizza dough that's already prepared. So first, you're gonna wanna put your dough on the floured pizza peel. And then, with gentle, curved fingers, you're gonna wanna start pulling the dough from the center, trying to make a round shape with some raised edges. And don't worry about shape. The more irregular and imperfect, the more character it adds to the shape of the pizza. Whoa, 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 whoa. I got this, man. Meanwhile, here are some tips about bringing women over. First, bring them to a nice place, not your mom's basement. This isn't my mom's basement. <laughs> yeah, right. You just happen to rent a place from someone who has pictures of you all over the wall. <laughs> Guys, that's what landlords do. They have pictures of their tenant when they were three years old on a bus stop on a regular basis. Also, never. Never bring a woman on a live TV show without a warning. That being said, I think you're doing great Sharon from someone who's been ambushed. Oh, thanks Renzo. For someone who's only in it for the Wi-Fi password, you're also doing great. We're just that awesome. <laughs> <laughs> now, make sure to only use the best ingredients for your pizza, but stay away from fresh mozzarella. It's too watery. Mm -hmm. Renzo, do you want to pick out some fresh toppings to place on the pizza? Sure. Uh, could get some paper, and mushrooms, and uh, some salami maybe? Perfect! Wow, you have a very really nice hands, Sharon. Oh, thanks, Renzo. Oh, you have really nice hands too. Do you use lotion? Twice a day. I'm not an animal. <laughs> Why you bring this a stranger to your house? Excuse me? Mom! No! No! Sick pizza, man, all things considered. Thought it might come and sing there, there. Another day, another flow. Watching the lathe and watching the dough. Ah. 
sweating for some loving, sweating by the oven. Climbing the mountain of internet fame. The only thing we've got to lose is our good name. Nothing dies in digital. So here we are, getting in medieval. medieval. She asked the strange answer. No trust lady with us like that. She has the hands on her evil plumber.